Hello, and welcome to Popcorn News. Something to watch while you eat popcorn. In the previous Popcorn News, it was revealed how the character Hickey from the play The Iceman Cometh was urging that to find peace, you had to give up hope. The way Hickey has found peace is to give up hope. That's kind of a paradox. Hickey used to have hope, but then he lost hope. And when he lost hope, he found peace. But Larry Slade, portrayed by Robert Ryan in the 1973 film version of Eugene O'Neill's play, is wishy-washy. He can't decide for sure about what Hickey is preaching. No, it doesn't look good, Rocky. I mean, the peace Hickey's brought you. He doesn't content it enough if you have to make a pimp of everything else. However, Harry Hope, portrayed by Frederick March, has been converted to Hickey's advice to give up hope. And it has ruined his drinking. Oh, when are you going to do something about this booze, Hickey? We can't pass out. And you promised us peace. Theodore Hickey Hickman, portrayed by Lee Marvin, gives it one last try and tries to explain. Thanks. You've all done what you needed to do. By right, you should be contented with yourself free from lying hopes and nagging dreams. Hickey has found peace. Or at least he says so. Don't worry about the chair, Larry. I know you're still terrified by death. But when you've made peace with yourself, like I have, you won't give a damn. Poor Harry Hope. His drunken existence has been ruined by having his pipe dreams taken away. We want to surpass out and get drunk. Have a little peace. All right, if that's the way you feel. I don't want to cram it down your throats. I don't need to tell anyone. I don't feel guilty. I'm only worried about you. Hickey, we find, had recently given his peace to Evelyn, but then Hickey slips and lets loose with his real feelings about Evelyn. And then I saw that I'd always known that was the only possible way to give her peace and free her from the misery of loving me. And I saw it meant peace for me too, knowing she was at peace. I felt as though a ton of guilt was lifted off my mind. I remember I stood by the bed and suddenly I had a laugh. I couldn't help it. And I knew Evelyn would forgive me. I remember I heard myself speaking to her as though it was something that I'd always wanted to say. Well, you know what you can do with your pipe dream now. You damn bitch! You damn bitch! Hickey has slipped, and Harry Hope rushes into the opening. Hickey is crazy. That must mean he is wrong about giving up hope and finding peace. You know I couldn't have said that to Evelyn, don't you? Unless... And you've been crazy ever since. Everything you said and done here. Oh, you... Governor, up to your old tricks, eh? I see what you're driving at, but I can... Yes, of course, sir. 
I've been out of my mind ever since. Ever since I've been here. You saw I was insane, didn't Hippie you? Hippie is crazy. That solves the problem. Hey, dumb pick. You got a crush trying to tell us about Hickey. We've known him for years. And every one of us noticed he was nutty the minute he showed up here. If you'd seen the damn fool things he made us do. We only did him because we... Because we, we hoped he, he'd come out of it if we kid him along and humor him. Ain't that right, fellas? Hickey leaves. And now, since what he said has been crazy, the drinking and the hopes for a better tomorrow can begin again. He's gone. <laughs> Poor crazy son of a bitch. <laughs> but Jesus, I need a drink. Maybe it'll have the old kick now he's gone. Yeah, boss. Maybe we can get drunk now. So things are back to usual at Harry Hope's saloon. That hickey was crazy, no doubt about it. <laughs> It's good to hear someone laugh again. All the time that, bass, uh, that, that uh, poor old Hickey was here, I didn't have the heart. Jesus, uh, I'm getting drunk and glad of it. <laughs> Come on, fellas. It's on the house. <laughs> but Larry Slade, the wishy-washy one, can't decide. Maybe Hickey was not crazy. For Larry, the party is still over. Christ. Why don't he? Why don't he what? Ah, don't be a fool. Hickey is gone. He was crazy. We could have a drink. What's the matter with you, lady? You look funny. What do you listen for out in the backyard? What's the matter, lady? You look scared. What do you listen for? What's the matter, lady? Why, you keep your eyes shut. What? You look dead. What do you listen for in the backyard? You crazy fool. You give me bad dreams, too. 